Good afternoon, Pats fans, and welcome inside the Brand Center as we tee up tonight's Cancer Awareness Night action between the Regina Pats and the visiting Saskatoon Blades as the Pats begin a crucial four-game homestand. My name is Dante DiCaria, and he's Drew Posty, and we are supporting some neat merchandise, which is now available at the Regina Pats store. It's Cancer Awareness Night merchandise, and the Pats will be donning those Cancer Awareness Night jerseys tonight. Drew, how excited are you for tonight's game? Yeah, it's, uh, it's really catchy, and obviously it's for a great cause. Um, this is a disease that affects basically everyone, some more than others, and uh, every year it's just such an important night, and uh, it's always such a nice night with the merchandise like you mentioned, and obviously the special jerseys, so uh, uh, it's really nice. I like this bunny hug a lot that you gave me. Yeah, Cancer Awareness Night game is such a crucial game in the season for the Regina Pats to host, and one neat thing about tonight's game, Drew, is that there's going to be an I Fight for a Wall right across from the Regina Pats store where fans can go write messages uh, for loved ones that they may have lost or how they've been affected by cancer. So that's kind of a neat new component that we've added this year. And a big thanks to 22 Fresh who have helped design these jerseys and this new merchandise, which is available at the Regina Pats store. And the jerseys will be auctioned after tonight's game. But Drew, let's talk about tonight's matchup between the Regina Pats and the visiting Saskatoon Blades. The Pats are beginning a big home stand and they're trying to get back in the win column tonight. Yeah, after winning four in a row, they've lost their last two. And hey, this is a Saskatoon team that, like expected, is shaping up to be a very strong team in the Western Hockey League this year. Uh, the games that they've played, it's been 5-1 for the Pats and then 6-1 for the Blades, so it hasn't really been an even game yet that we've seen, so uh, we might see a lot of goals or maybe we'll see the opposite tonight, uh, but I'm expecting the Pats to come out with a lot of fire looking to get back into the win column. Yeah, Drew, it's funny you mention that because in fact, 11 of 13 games this season have been decided by two goals or less for the Regina Pats. Yeah, except really against the Saskatoon Blades, obviously, so uh, you don't know exactly. what you're going to see. Uh, obviously, they want to limit the goal total last time and the shot total last time it was just one of those games that they want to forget in Saskatoon but the one before that was the home opener and it was a great game against the Blades for the Regina Pats so we'll have to see what team we get tonight. And uh, obviously Braxton Whitehead is out for six to eight weeks with an upper body injury and we wish him all the best in his recovery. Uh, before we wrap up this preview Drew, uh, the Pats have had that next man up mentality throughout the course of the season. 13 different players have scored at least a goal for the Pats. 19 different players have recorded at least a point. So I guess that continues without Whitehead in the lineup. Yeah, obviously Braxton Whitehead, it's going to be a big loss. Uh, he's taken yet another step this year and has really stepped up his offensive game. But uh, secondary scoring has kind of been a trend that we've seen throughout the whole season so far for the Regina Pats. And that next man up mentality has worked great for them so far. They've gotten scoring up and down the lineup. So as big of a loss as it is to lose Braxton Whitehead, Whitehead. I think the team has a lot of confidence knowing that they've been getting that secondary scoring throughout the season. Good stuff, Drew. That's all you need to know for tonight's action between the Regina Pats and the visiting Saskatoon Blades in a crucial four-game homestand. And remember, tonight is Cancer Awareness Night. And if you'd like to purchase some of these uh, cancer merchandise that Drew and I are wearing right now, uh, make sure to head to the Regina Pats stores as the proceeds will go to the Cancer Society of Saskatchewan. The Pats will also be donning some Cancer Awareness Night jerseys, which are pretty uh, cool as well. And uh, those will be auctioned off after the game, for details on how to place your bid, head to reginapats.com. Doors open at 6, puck dropped at 7 o'clock. We'll see you tonight.